I'm Jason Bilal and welcome to Listening Party. In this episode, we're going to be talking to badass femwave punk rockers from Calgary, Alberta, the Chivarettes, about their politics, their rock and roll, and their brand new record, Dead Men Can't Catcall. So, let's check it out. Uh, I am Kaylee. I play guitar and sing a little bit. I'm Cecilia. I play bass and sing, and sing a little bit. <laughs> uh, I'm Haley, lead, lead vocals. My name is Steve and I play drums. Uh, so Haley and I started the band about four years ago. We had a different rhythm section at the time. Um, I was playing a bit of guitar at home, but like not really doing much in terms of being in a band. Uh, Haley was someone I kind of knew through Beetroot and through a few other things in the music scene in Calgary and she just asked if I wanted to start a band and write some songs and so yeah we did that about four years ago and I've just kind of been plugging away at it um, added this new rhythm section about two years ago um, and have really kind of solidified things since then well the new record our first like full-length record which is exciting uh is called dead men can't cat call and uh which is the name of the kind of lead single from the album um we recorded it at a buddy's kind of garage studio in calgary last spring um we listen to a lot of punk music so we're listening to coat hangers uh childbirth x hex um, basically a lot of rad women that are making really, really cool punk music, so I think that's a big influence. in an, uh, a conversation with a friend that really stuck with me, he was asking if we consider ourselves to be a political band. And uh, Kaylee's response was just that, you know, even just that we're three of four band members are women and we're making fairly loud music inherently that's going to be political. Um, and I think because we write from our day-to-day -day experiences and, you know, we're fairly socially aware and active um, since that's where we write from, it's just that's where it ends up and I mean you know I write non no, songs that aren't like that as well you know just kind of um, breakup songs or love songs or sad songs but they because of the nature of the world and our genders in comparison to that it, it tends to um, take on a political lens no matter what we do so it's just bound to happen and I'm okay with that I you know I like politics so it just it just happens uh, one cool story, there's cat meows on the album, so <laughs> we've really like doubled down on this cat theme that we're doing. So we started off with the song Dead Men Can't Cat Call and kind of decided that was the direction we wanted to go with the album. Uh, it's the best song we've written, we think. <laughs> so yeah, so we kind of took that theme and, and went with it and Haley had an idea one day like, let's just have cats meowing on the album. So we put a call out on Facebook and Twitter and it's just like, hey, friends, send us send us audio of your cats meowing and so did that recorded my cat recorded Haley's cat and sent it to to our recording guy and we're like hey can you add this into the album somehow good luck uh so our so our lead single dead men can't cat call has like four or five different cats meowing at the beginning of it which i think is a pretty cool intro to a song lots of people do tend to point out the fact that i'm the only guy in the band and it i i don't really see it that way i'm just one component of the band and I see no difference in it whatsoever uh, it's just uh, three other friends that I'm playing in a band with and that's just the way that I look at it buy a record right like you can get it on Bandcamp and iTunes and all that fun stuff um, buy the record 
follow us on Facebook and Instagram and stuff. I think we're funny and, uh, <laughs> you know, interesting. Um, but yeah, buy the record. It's great. And uh, we want to be able to make a new one. So we need some money in order to do that. <laughs> <That's a> good <laughs> plug. <laughs> uh, we're also... We are playing Ottawa Explosion, so that's kind of exciting for us. We're going to be heading out to Ottawa, probably do a Montreal show when we're out there as well. So that's in June, middle of June. Um, so I don't know, we're pretty excited about that to kind of expand our reach a little bit and hopefully get some new fans out there. So if anybody over in the Ontario, Quebec kind of region likes femme punk, check us out. <laughs> yeah. 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 Hey, thanks for joining me and the Shiverettes here on another episode of Listening Party. If you want to get some more from the band, make sure you follow them on Facebook to keep up with news and tour schedules, as well as download their new album, Dead Men Can't Cat Call, from their band camp. Uh, join me next time on Evolution 1079's Listening Party. I'm Jason Delisle.